Hi everyone, we're back in Fortnite. It's Chapter 4, Season 4. There's been a little update. We can see the time machine on the main screen here now. And they also added new snapshot quests. They're maze quests. So let's get in the game and see what those quests are. The first one is to deal explosive damage to opponents. I did not realize the quests were back in the game. Here we go. Whoops. And somehow, as you guys can see, I got the quest completed and it was assisted by a different player. I have no idea how that happened. It was a solo match. Anyway, the quest was done. So let's take a look at the next quest. These are the quests. So the second one says use shield breaker EMP to disable a vehicle and a turret. I got the shield breaker and there is a vehicle and one part is complete. So let's go find a turret now. I am at Sanguine Suits and there's usually turrets down here. Let's use that and the quest is done. The next quest is to talk to Nolan Chance or Fish Sick. I'm here at the Frenzy Fields. I will try talking to Nolan Chance. There he is. So I did go to look for fish stick first, but I could not find him at his house. All right, I spoke to fish stick. He's May's best friend. Not like I wanted a best friend or anything. You're gonna have to get a little reckless to catch her attention, but you do reckless very, very well, right, best friend, or just regular friend? Sorry, I was trying it on. Great, so that is done. Now it looks like we need to secure forecast towers. And while I was in the game, another thing I noticed, there was more quests to complete. One of them was to survive storm cycles. Um, let's take a look. Here we go. So there's actually three quests. The forecast towers, you have to collect the bars from eliminated players, and also survive storm phases. You have to survive ten of them. And let's pick up this gold. So for each eliminated player, you get 15 bars of gold. And I'm halfway with the Storm Phases quest. And there's more gold, some 30 out of 75 pieces that I need. And just like that, to survive Storm Phases quest is done. Now, let's get this boss. Awesome, so to secure forecast towers, you have to defeat the boss and get this um, key card from him. He also has two guards with him, so you will probably have to eliminate them as well. 
Once you pick up the key card, you have to go to the tower and use the card on it. You guys can see I already completed one part of the quest, and this is the second one. And after you do that three times, that's when the quest will be completed. And after that, you will have to go and talk to me. Here she is. Let's see what she's got to say. You're formidable, and I love blowing stuff up. We'd make a pretty great pretty great team, but just FYI, Kado's up to something super sinister. I found some schmatics lurking behind his firewall. Any idea what a chrono cell is? I kind of want to know before I, you know, risk everything I have. That's what she says, and now we we'll have to go deal damage to Revenant Kado Thorn and collect chrono cells. And you will find um, cut a thorn at the eclipsed estate down at the vault right inside here. So let's maybe open a couple of these chests first. Okay, I think I'm ready. I just need to damage him twice. And there he is. And I don't really need to eliminate him, I just wanted the chrono cells. Now we need to enter a rift to charge the chrono cells. You can do that upstairs at the Eclipsed Estate. So there is the rift. And the next quest is to talk to Nolan Chance. We are back at Frenzy Fields. Maze on board. That's good for the heist and very, very bad for my explosives budget. Honestly, I don't know if we could have pulled it off without her. We're almost there. Once we deliver what Sloan is after, you and I are going to be talking easy street. Now we need to go and hire May. Oh, thanks, May. And I'm pretty sure there is more quests. Let's see. Um, collect a sticky grenade launcher from an eliminated opponent or chest and to destroy structures with remote explosives. I got some remote explosives. Let's place them here and here. There we go. Let's go outside. Okay, where's May? Come out. I don't want to explode you as well. Okay. Awesome. That quest is halfway done. So that's how you get to destroy structures with remote explosives and here I was lucky I found the sticky grenade launcher in the chest I wasn't able to get one from any of the eliminated opponents that's a tricky one you never know what kind of weapons they have so that was nice to find it inside the chest 
And once you complete all of the maze quests, this is the style you get as a reward. Quests are completed. And that's all we need to do in this round of Snapshot Quests. Thank you all for watching. Please like and subscribe. And we'll see you all next time. Bye!